Hey guys, welcome to the extras channel, and I'm assuming you just watched the main channel and want to know how to make random cash or how to make a GUI appear, uh, like when you collect a coin. So we'll be doing the random cash first. So what you want to do is go into the add coin script, and then after the remote event, go down the line and write local random cash equals to math.random, some brackets should appear. You can input any two numbers, for example, 25 comma 100. That means it will choose a random number between 25 and 100. Just make sure that between the two numbers, you have a comma, and the first number is always lower than the second. After that, you can go down here into the cache.value. Instead of 5, delete the 5, and just write random cache. And that is the entire script. Um, and to make sure that it does work, we're just going to go print the random cache value to show you that it does work. And that that's the entire script, so let's go test it out. Okay, so here I am, everything's the same. But this time, if we were to collect a coin, instead of plus 5 cache, we get plus 89. And if we go into the output, as you can see, the random number generated was 89. So yeah, that's how you make a random cache. It could be any two values, uh, whatever two values you want. So the next thing I'm going to show you guys is how to make a GUI pop up when you collect the coin. So first we need the actual GUI. So go to starter GUI, click the plus, enter in a screen GUI. Under the screen GUI, click the plus, enter in a text label. And you can just rename it to show amount. Or it doesn't, doesn't really matter. And then you want to put the GUI where you want the coin to show up. So I'm just going to put it like right there. And then you want to go into the properties of it and you can customize it however you want. Just make sure that the text is blank. There's nothing on there. And then, uh, but for now, we're just going to put like some random stuff so we can actually see the text. Uh, I'm going to make it yellow, uh, text scaled. And I'm also going to make it bold. So this is how it will show up. Now, I don't like the background. So I'm also going to go to the background and make it transparent. So this is how the money will show up. And once you like uh, how it will show up, you can just delete the text. After that, what you want to do is take the add coin script and just drag it under the show amount uh, or like their text label. Open up the script and add one more variable, which is local text label equals to script.parent. And then what you want to do is after the plus random cache, go down the line and write text label dot text equals to put quotation marks plus space dollar sign outside the quotation marks, put dot dot, and then you can put random cache. And after that, you can go down the line or you can also delete this because we already know that it works and then put task dot wait. And then you can put how many seconds you want it to wait. I'm going to put it at 2.5. And then text label dot text equals to quotation mark with a space. So this number here is how many seconds you want the GUI to stay on the screen before it goes blank again. And for testing purposes, I'm also going to delete the uh, destroy script to show you that it works consistently. And now we can go test it out. Okay, so here I am back in the game. If I go closer to it, we can collect the coin. Three, two, one. There you go, plus 69. That, that's a very funny number. But as you can see, we also have a GUI that pops up to show you exactly how much uh, cash you got by. So, extra 52, and then it adds that much to your cash total. So yeah, that'll be it for this extras video. If you found it helpful, make sure to like, comment, subscribe, and share. Also, tell me what other content I should post here, because I, I, I post like once a month. And the videos are really lightly edited. But yeah, that'll be it for today, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye!